The human race, where everyone is different, yet have the common goal to have more of this. Money is something that everyone in the world has become accustomed to and is used to having to use it in order to buy anything. But what if the world never had it? it's safe to assume that the world we've come to know today is a world accustomed to the notion that money does matter. But image a world where the concept of money never existed or mattered. What would that world look like? Today, the average cost for food for one person for one month is 302 US dollars. That would be equivalent to 243.30 euros, 192.90 British pounds, and 1,854.82 Chinese yuan. Plus an average electric bill for any American ranges from $279 per month to over $500 depending on which state you live in. Also, gasoline costs an average driver in the U.S. roughly $2,000 per year. That's a lot of money. But what if, what if it never existed? What would our world economy be like? How would we get our goods and services? And most importantly, how would our society be shaped and would people be happy? How would our economy be shaped if money never existed? Well, let me first start off by saying our industrialized economy that we're accustomed to today would probably not exist, for good or for bad, because today the U.S. unemployment rate is currently at 5.8%, which translates to 9,110,000 Americans are currently without work, according to the Better Business Bureau. Also, the world is currently $54 trillion in debt, and that number is expected to rise to $55 trillion this next year, with the debt rising $300,000 every four seconds. What would our world economy be like then? Many think Masanobu Fukuya's natural farming and permaculture would exist if money did it. The system was created by Masanobu Fukuya, a farmer slash philosopher who lives in southern Japan. His farming techniques require no machines, no chemicals, and less labor, and in return it produces so much food. In fact, the technique of plowing the soil or the use of prepared compost is not used, and yet the condition of the soil improves each year. Instead of paying workers money, the owner of the farm would pay workers in abundant amounts of food. Which leads to, if money doesn't exist, how would we acquire our goods and services we need? The barter system would probably be the most logical answer. The barter system, which dates back to 6000 BC, was widely used by the ancient Mesopotamian tribes, but in fact, it was used by many ancient tribes during that time era. What's different about the barter system is it doesn't involve money. Also, you can exchange goods you no longer use for goods you would use. Would there be unfair deals? That's very possible. But you could also buy a good for a service. And finally, what would our society look like if money never existed or mattered? According to the FBI crime statistics, there were a total of 5,014 bank robberies in the year 2011 totaling in $38,343,501.96 in cash, securities, face values, checks, food stamps, and another property. But if money never existed, would any of those robberies taken place? My answer is no, because there would have been nothing to be taken if money never existed. Also, would people in general be more happy? According to Mental Health Daily, money and financial problems are on the top 15 reasons as to why people commit suicide every year. And according to the CDC, nearly 1 million people commit suicide every year. That doesn't even account for the number of people that try any year either. Just think, without money ever existing, that number could be dramatically be cut back. How do you image a world if money never existed or mattered? Possibly different than mine? Am I right? No. Are you right? No. Nobody is right because our world didn't turn out that way. Money has been invented, and it does matter. A lot. To a lot of people. I like this quote from Winston Churchill. It's always lies to look ahead, but difficult to look further than you can see. Is it true to say it will never happen? No, because we don't know what the future brings. Only time will tell us that.